Hi Sureen. Hello sir. How are you? Hi sir. Congratulations on your achievement. Uh, how are you feeling about this? Uh, sir, uh, right after giving the exam, it felt unreal. But upon giving, like upon receiving my marks, I think it is a complete new experience. Cause like first time, it's the first time giving such a big exam, first time receiving these marks, and yeah, um, I was satisfied with the marks I got. So yeah, I'm pretty happy right now with it. Great, Great. amazing, amazing. How was your journey? Tell us about your journey here. Uh, any hurdles that you faced, and how did how did you recover from those? Uh, I think that my journey actually began here with it. Uh, I began here with the school level kind of syllabus, and then it gradually developed to JE because I had I was uh, when I initially joined ATP, I was focused more on uh, school level syllabus, and then I I also did join the JE classes, and then it gradually shifted to the JE classes. And upon joining the JE classes, I seem it seemed that it was. Very very helpful for me, and I was getting the type of guidance and support I required, and I think that's one of the main reasons I'm here today with these marks. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Can you recall any incident during your journey that uh, you feel that helped you shaped uh, your journey in this? Uh, I yeah, uh, I recall that um, I did have multiple meetings with you concerning the J syllabus and my attempts, my efforts towards it, and we did have few challenges here and there for. The tests, uh, tests which I was taking. So I recall having a challenge, or challenge two, in which we had it, uh, where we are supposed to meet a certain limit, like certain amount of marks, and the amount of happiness I got after actually meeting that was pretty unbelievable. I think that kind of motivated me, showing me my potential and how much I could actually get. Amazing, amazing, amazing. What advice would you give to the students who are going to write J next year or next to next year? Uh, there's a huge hype about how hard J means is and. Up until you give the exam, I think it's this is like mental block in your in your brain that it's very very hard. But upon giving the advice, it, upon giving the exam, it's uh, like you will understand that it's actually much more easy than it seems. But that doesn't mean you don't put in effort. It only become easy if you put in the effort, and if you do cover the syllabus. And there is a certain uh, like certain way to take the JE exams, and um, I'd say that there's certain division of subjects, certain way to focus on the subjects, and I think that as seen in the Exams you're taking till now, physics is the most easiest, and then chemistry, and then maths. And maths has usually been the lengthiest. So do equally distribute the subjects, but also do focus on physics and chem mainly because it's the easiest for you. Nice, nice. Okay, okay. So what what kind of support, what parts of ATP did you like the most during this? We did have an option to stay in ATP and study after the classes were over the whole day, and I think that greatly helped me because personally I did have focus like. Like attention issues, I couldn't focus too long on something. And sitting at ATP with the guidance and support, and where people with admins are watching us, I think that did help a lot and helped me develop my attention span. And that was one of the main reasons I was able to like, after, even after I stopped coming to ATP to sit, sit here and study, I was able to go at home and sit and study and focus on it. So basically, your attention span got longer because you spent longer studying under our supervision, and therefore uh, that continued even at home later. Yeah, because I think that sometimes you do require a little push and a little nudge in the correct direction, and I think that's what we received here at ATP. Perfect, perfect, amazing, amazing. Anything do you want to say to your parents about this? Because they were regularly in touch with me. Uh, yeah, I would actually. I think the I think the biggest factor in all of all like in getting how much I got and in getting reaching this stage was my parents' support, because I don't think that with the amount of the support I got to come here in taxi, the amount of time I got to go back home, the amount of time I got to spend here, and the money for food and whatnot. Without their support and their emo, like them being there emotionally for me and mentally for me also, I don't think so it would be possible for me to survive this one past one two years and come out with these marks. Amazing, Sureen. Amazing. I'm I'm really glad that you gave so much of credit to your parents and you are grateful for the support they also gave you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Very happy for you, Sureen. Very Thank happy. You, sir.